Welcome back to Fun on the Run. Dallas may not be the motor city, but we have plenty of motorheads around North Texas. So if you love cars, Landon Wixler has a spot for you. Being a car person or a gearhead is a lifestyle. For those who just can't get enough of classic cars, it's time to take a trip to Ford's Garage. <laughs> Garage is a 1920s inspired garage bar uh, with the intention of bringing people together over prime burgers and craft beer. Inspired by Henry Ford and licensed by the Ford Motor Company, all the car parts, engine blocks, and cars inside the restaurant are authentic, 100 years old, out of a 1920 or 30 Model A or Model T. Many of the car parts for this location came right here from the Dallas Model A Club, uh, courtesy of uh, the Dallas Model A Club members. So we're very excited to have uh, authentic parts right here from a local club. And we currently have four vehicles on the property. We've got a 1929 Model A Tudor that sits above the bar, a 28 Roadster here that actually runs, and two more 29 uh, Model A's out front, a Tudor and a Slant. The inspiration behind the design of the building was a 1920s filling station on the outside. So taking some of the elements that you would have seen in the 1920s, uh, putting uh, putting replica uh, gas pumps in, showcasing the, the, the Model A's out front. Whether you're eight years old and you walk in, you see the tires spin on the car, or you're 80 years old and you come in and realize you grew up with these vehicles or had a dad or a grandpa that worked at Ford. Uh, it's amazing how the Ford family's extended its generational. Those are four engine blocks out of a 1930 Model A that actually ran, that we've taken and um, uh, renovated so that we can have them on display here. The, the car tires spin, we blow fog out of the tailpipe every 30 minutes, and uh, we celebrate birthdays and anniversaries with the Aruga horn. Uh, comes on every 30 minutes as well. Henry Ford was an innovator of things such as the assembly line, um, the Model T, which became the universal car, as well as um, streamlining the, the mechanical side of how to keep the Model A and Model T cars running on the road. So we celebrate uh, that innovation by how we operate in the restaurant. We also celebrate the history of the Ford Motor Company by creating an environment where our team members celebrate what we call one team. and. Uh, uh, just the culture that we bring to um, celebrating serving great burgers here and cold beer. We'll see that we've got LED backlit walls really to uh, resemble a time during Prohibition where you may have been bootlegging liquor overnight in the barn and when the sun came up that light would penetrate through that barn wood and you would know it was time to wrap up their equipment and, and, get, and get back to shop so the backlit walls kind of emulate, emulates that. One of the most exciting things since being open here for the last two and a half months has been the energy around the car club scene in Dallas, which is just off the charts. We have uh, 12 Burgers of Fame on the menu, uh, over 80 craft beers, bottles, cans, and drafts. Our burgers are uh, fresh, uh, hand patted in-house every day. Any of our 12 Burgers of Fame can be made with different proteins, so you can make them with a Black Angus patty, a bison patty, a house-made veggie burger, a turkey burger, a piece of grilled chicken, or a piece of fried chicken. The hand-breaded chicken tenders, as well as our uh, homemade meatloaf and um, uh, uh, baby bag ribs. The menu really lends itself to no matter what kind of diet you're on or what you're in the mood for. One of the most exciting parts about putting together the beer list was partnering with all the local breweries that we have here throughout Dallas. Y'all, this place is like a theme park for car lovers and gearheads alike. And according to Jason, this is not the last location in the DFW area coming. There's more on the way. Learn more on CW33.com.